What's up YouTube? Jeff back again today with a very exciting Samsung video for you guys. And today we have an update to one of Samsung's best apps for keeping your notifications more organized. I'm talking about Notice Star. Uh, if you don't use it, you definitely should. And I'll talk a little more about what it does in today's video. But there's an update that gives even more amazing features. I'm going to talk about that right now. Before we get started, I do want to thank my son Jonathan. He always gives some dinos to hang out. We have the very cool Cronosaurus from the Jurassic World collection today. And the Snap Squad T-Rex over here. Really excited about that. We always appreciate him. He's very excited for Christmas and he always loves when you guys talk about the dinosaurs down in the comments. Also want to remind you guys, if you want to save some money on your wireless service, you can do so by switching to my partners over at Mint Mobile. Mint Mobile has premium wireless and right now for a limited time, get one of their best deals of the year. You get three months free when you buy any three month plan. Uh, this does run through January 1st, 2024. Right now, that's the current end date. So it is limited time. You have a couple weeks to take advantage. Mint, as always, has a five gig plan. They've got a 15 gig plan, 20 gig plan, and they also have a unlimited plan. And uh, you can see that right now you're basically getting six months for the usual price. So 90 bucks would actually be for six months in case of the uh, unlimited plan. All their plans come with unlimited talk and text, nationwide coverage, mobile hotspot included as well. Very simple to switch to Mint, either an eSIM, which is great because if you're traveling about for the holidays, you can activate it wherever you are. You don't need to be at home to get a physical SIM kit in the mail. Or if you get a physical SIM, they'll also send you out a SIM tool. Pop out your old SIM, pop in the mint SIM, let the savings begin. I've been using it. My family's been using them here in the Phoenix, Arizona metro area for the last 14 months. Love the service. Fantastic. Save a lot of money over big wireless. If you want to take advantage of this limited time offer, go to trymintmobile.com slash springer. The link is right here. It'll also be in the pinned comment and description. Again, limited time offer. So if you want to check it out, do so as soon as possible. We do appreciate Mint for being partners on this channel. So the update rolled out. I just got it last night to Notistar. Really haven't been a lot of Samsung app updates, good lock updates lately. So uh, Noti Star, of course, is over here on the life up side of good lock. It's right here. Uh, and this one's actually a fairly large update. So let me go into the store really quick and show you. Here it is. Version 6.0.32.0. Says it rolled out December 14th. I didn't get it until the 18th. Um, 9.51 megabytes. And uh, you can see here the new features, fix layout bug. So that's, of course, just a bug fix. Support the Flip 5 cover widget, which is something that uh, Samsung's had for quite a while, which is great. Uh, and then fix the bug that lock screen icon is remaining on the home screen. Now, this is a bug I did experience, and I'll show you what they're talking about in just a second. These are the two new features. Show bigger image if the notification has an image. This is perfect for Instagram notifications. And long press the notification to save the image. This one is fantastic. If you see an Instagram post or image come through your notifications that you like, or it could be from Twitter, any other app that's pushing out an image, you can just long press on that and save it directly to your gallery on your Samsung phone. So those of you who don't know what uh, Notistar does, it's a very simple app. It basically catalogs all of your notifications here and uh, lets you scroll through them, saves all of them for the whole day so you can kind of see all your notifications. Uh, and when you do get in, let me actually see if I can find an Instagram post. I don't want to put anyone on blast, but let me see if I can find an Instagram image or from something else. Here is an image right here. This is from Samsung News, actually. And so you can see right here that if I have this image, you can see they used to just have a small preview. Now it's a larger one. And if I want to save this, I can long press and save the image, copy or share. So I copy and paste this to a social post, save to my gallery, or so if I save image, she's going to save it to my gallery. Or you could go ahead and share it. It'll go ahead and bring up your share menu down here and you'll be able to go ahead and go right in there and uh, do any sharing with quick share, uh, Samsung um, sharing, WhatsApp messages, email, all that good, great stuff that we enjoy and love to do. So the way you access this typically, you can also search your notifications up here for those of you guys who haven't seen it before. And you can go into settings and uh, change the application list that appears, the filter list. Uh, you can have the lock screen arrow, which I'll show you. That's how I like to use it. Uh, start icon settings, so you can here have, you know, access photos, videos, all that kind of stuff um, to have different icons that you want. Sync with screen lock, quick access available when the lock is not set or unlock by face or extend lock. Uh, else launch notice star. And then you can also choose how long you want to store your period uh, for the notifications. They also have a lab feature where you can set app unable to clear notifications. This would mean that you would have the ability to stop certain apps from clearing from your notification shade. I showed this before in a previous video, which I'll link below. Also a very useful feature, although it's not one that I find that is one that I use a lot, but it is a very useful one if you want to allow certain notifications to remain in your shade for viewing. 
Now on the lock screen, this is how it appears. It appears with an arrow like this right here. That's what this arrow is above the fingerprint sensor. A lot of people always ask me what this is when they see videos. And then when you put in your fingerprint pattern or whatever, then it's gonna take you right into the Notice Star list of notifications. Now the bug that they're talking about is that this particular arrow right here that they fixed, which was a big one, this arrow, when you use your fingerprint, it would actually appear on the screen. So like if you went into your Twitter, you're scrolling down your Twitter, you would have this arrow still right in the middle of your screen as you were looking through other applications. So obviously that's probably not something good. So they fixed that error. It was something that did I did experience several times using Notice Star, um, but now that's been repaired. This is pretty huge update, honestly. Um, pretty big update because being able to long press and save the image is certainly useful. I get a lot of Instagram notifications where I'm like, wow, that's a pretty cool uh, image or something. I have post notifications turned on for a particular poster because um, a lot of my hobby is like collecting fountain pens and things like that over on Instagram. If I want to save a pen photo for later to kind of look at that pen, uh, see if it's something I'm interested in, I can save that to my gallery. Lots of very useful um, use cases for that particular feature. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. Go check out the update. Let me know if you're using Notice Star. I find it to be one of the best good luck apps out there for categorizing, organizing notifications, and reviewing later on. Blows the iOS notification system out of the water even more than Android already did. If you want to save some money on your wireless service, again, check out my partners at Mint Mobile. Try mintmobile.com slash Springer. You can check it out right there. Limited time offer ends on January 1st, 2024. So a couple weeks. Take advantage of that before it ends. Appreciate you guys watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.